Hi everybody, it's Mook again. Today's project that I've never done before is forge welding. I just want to do it to see if I can. I know nothing about it. I've never done it before, um, but I'm going to give it a try. Uh, trial and error. That, that's how I'm going to try to learn this stuff. Okay, what I want to do is uh, forge weld this high carbon O1 steel in a sandwich of this low carbon mild steel, like so, and then I imagine, uh, you know, the principle would be that I would draw this out and make a knife and I would have uh, softer, more resilient steel on the outside and a harder steel cutting edge right there. Right now I just want to see if I can get these three pieces of metal to stick together. Um, the O1 steel I ordered online, the uh, mild steel I picked up at the uh, big box hardware store. What I'm going to do, uh, the other things I need is I need some steel wire and I need some borax. What I know about this is the, the mating surfaces of the different pieces of metal have to be clean, uh, they have to be scale free. Um, so I'm going to heat these pieces up individually. Now, I don't know if this is the right way to do it, but this is what I'm going to do. I'm going to heat these pieces up individually, um, brush off any scale that results, I'm going to let them cool down enough so that I can wire them together in a sandwich with this steel wire. Once they're together, I heat them up again, put some of this borax on it, let it melt in there as a flux. Now what that's going to do is it's going to make an oxygen poor atmosphere uh, between the layers of the steel so that scale doesn't form. I'm going to heat it up really really hot and I'm going to pull it out of the fire and bang the hell out of it on the anvil and see if it sticks. So that's my plan. Metal cooled down enough so that I can handle it. And now I've got the thin piece of O1 steel sandwiched by the, the two pieces of mild steel. Now I left the I left this one long so I can just hang on to it while I'm doing my work. Now this is steel wire. Um, my expectation is that this will hold these pieces together long enough to get hot enough that I can start. Uh, forge welding, and then they'll just they'll just pop off and fly away. They, I, I don't expect that these will be incorporated in to what I'm doing here. Um, that's what I expect. So anyway, this next shot I'm just going to uh, set up kind of a wide angle because I imagine I'll, I'll be moving pretty quick on this. Um, I'm gonna heat it, get it very very hot. Uh, I'll pull it out of the fire. I'll put the flux on it, and then I'll just bang the hell out of it. As you saw, that did not work at all. So I'm going to try a, a different approach. I'm going to I'm going to take this. I'm going to fold this over. Then I'm going to slide the shim of uh, hard steel in there. Then I'll try to forge it. Again, this is all just learning.
Well, obviously, I'm doing something wrong, but that's uh, well, that's the way it goes when you're just trying to experiment, see how things work. Anyway, thanks for watching. And if anybody has any suggestions, let me know.